Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'll be showing you how to create multiple Gmail accounts. Before we start, hurry up and check out these offer just under this video. Let's get started. So, you're looking for a way to create multiple Gmail accounts here. But first, let's go and discuss how Gmail accounts work and if, are, if there are any limits in the accounts that you could cre uh, create for your uh, Gmail here. Now, the thing with Gmail here is uh, there's no exact limit on how many accounts you can create for Gmail. So, for all they know, you can create like 1,000 emails, 10 emails, or like 15 emails in the Gmail platform, and they wouldn't care uh, regarding that. But the thing with this one is if you're going to link, like for example, phone numbers, well, there's going to be certain limits uh, on how many phones or Gmail account that you can link on that specific phone number. Now, this is directly from a thread here. A user posted, how many Gmail accounts can a person have? Now, a lot of people here are saying that some of them can only create like around, around four accounts before a limit was set into their account. Now, this is due to because a phone number can only be uh, set uh, or can be used a number of times. But this depends on where you are. Some people have a limit of four. Some people have a limit of six. Now, if you do reach the limit here, like you've added or you created four or six Gmail account and you've used the same number over and over again on that Gmail account, on those Gmail accounts, well, you will have or you will be restricted on creating further Gmail accounts here with the same phone number. Now, if that's the case, you may need to use a different number in order for you to continue creating your Gmail account. Now, uh, with that said, there's no limit on how to create one. So usually speaking, you just need to go to your existing Gmail account here. So go to gmail.com and you can go and click on the add account option here and basically click on the create account option and just choose either for your personal use or for your work or your business. Now, just fill out or just follow the on-screen steps here in order for you to create your account. Now, by the way, if you want to see the full process of creating your Gmail account, we actually have a tutorial for that. So make sure to check out our channel. But yeah, so just follow the on-screen steps here to create your Gmail account. Now, if I'm not mistaken right now with the current process for Gmail, it's, it's not necessarily that you need to enter or use an existing phone number in the creation process for Gmail. Uh, Google accounts as of right now so you won't need to enter any numbers as of right now so you could just create your account uh, you could go and create a number of accounts if you want to so yeah so if you're just looking for a way to just like reuse your Gmail account here and still receive the same or use the same Gmail account over and over again well there is a way for you to use those different Gmail uh, or in order for you to create different gmail accounts but still use the same inbox here there's a way for that so i'll be showing you this cool trick here but then again this is not exactly creating a new gmail account it's more of like reusing uh and getting variants of your gmail here now what am i talking about so uh i just i have this specific G uh, gmail account here or email address now what i need to do is i need to use the plus then whatever word i want to use at gmail.com so this is my base email address. This is my username. So at the end of that, before the at here, you want to go and add a plus and just add whatever you want. Like, for example, I'm going to say first email. Let's go and copy this one. So this is the first variant of our email. Let's go ahead and go to our uh, Gmail here and let's go ahead and just send a quick message to ourselves. So to and you can go ahead and just add whatever you want. So let's just say this is going to be first test. Add it in here. And let's go and click on send. Now, once you've sent that, as you can see here now, this is our first uh, email that we just sent right now. Now, it is sent from the same, as you can see here now, from the following user to the following user. So it's a variant of our email address. We are able to still receive it in our original email address here. Now, let's go and try this to maybe a different account. Let's go ahead and uh, use this on my email e or my old email address or all my old gmail account here let's go and click on compose now by the way just to give you some idea there's a different email address here let's go and click on compose let's go ahead and add this specific email address that we just created before so again this is a different email address here this is going to be the testing one test one test one and click on send let's go back into our new email here and we've just received our email here. As you can see, this is test one here from the following email address and sent to this uh, recipient here that we just generated. Now, just to give you another idea here, let's go ahead and use a different variant here. Let's go ahead and say this is going to be a second email. 
let's go ahead and copy this one and use it as a set up a recipient go back in here click on compose again to let's go and say this is going to be test second okay paste it in here and let's go and click on send and as you can see it's still receiving although like there is a second variation of our email here we are able to uh, receive the email as well in here so yeah so if you're going to ask, are there any limits in creating multiple Gmail accounts here? Well, no, there are no limits. You can create an unlimited uh, amount of emails here, but the only restrictions is the use of a specific mobile number on your Gmail account. But if you just want to reuse your Gmail account here and just create variants of it, you just need to use this method here. So to make it a lot easier for you if you don't want to manage multiple email addresses at once. But yeah, so that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.